G'day. And welcome to Fe- <laughs> Hello, welcome to Ferry's Kitchen. Uh, what I'm going to cook for you tonight is a uh, chicken tikka masala skewer with a coriander dressing or dip to go with it. So I'll show you the ingredients and then we'll get ready to cook. Alright, here are all the ingredients. We've got two tablespoons of um, just your favourite tikka masala paste uh, that we're going to mix with a bit of the uh, Greek yogurt. We've got one and a half cups of Greek yogurt or about 400 grams that we're going to mix with that to marinate the chicken. About a kilo of uh, chicken thighs that I've just chopped up into two to three centimetre or one inch cubes so we can put that on the uh, on the skewers later. A bunch of coriander that I've, I've just roughly ripped with my hands. Two teaspoons of uh, caster sugar. A four centimetre piece of uh, ginger that I've just finely chopped. Two cloves of garlic that I've roughly chopped. About a quarter of a cup of uh, really good extra virgin olive oil and, and the juice of a lime and that's, that's pretty much it. So uh, we're ready to start marinating. Alright, to marinate the chicken we need one and a half cups, sorry one cup uh, of the uh, Greek style yogurt. So just one full tub and just a little bit out of the second tub. There we go, and your paste. We'll just stir that through. If you're keen, you can use your hands, but uh, I'm just going to use a spoon. It only takes a moment to mix it all through. And just pop that in your in your fridge for about half an hour, and then we can move on to uh, on onto the coriander dressing. Okay, to make the uh, coriander dressing, we pretty much just add all the other ingredients. So we'll just put, pop them into my processor. So garlic, lime juice, oil, sugar, ginger, and the coriander. We will just leave the uh, the extra Greek style yogurt till till just the last couple of pulses. So we'll just blitz this up until it's a, a little bit coarse. Okay, that's ready. We'll just put in the uh, leftover Greek style yogurt. Pop that in. This will only need a couple of seconds. And that, that's all finished, nice and bright green. Um, just pop that aside in a bowl uh, in the fridge until your, uh, your chicken's marinated. And then we're ready to pop them on the skewers and start to cook. All right, after about half an hour of marinating, all you gotta do now is put them under the skewers. If you are gonna cook this on a barbecue, just make sure you soak your skewers for about 10 minutes before, otherwise, uh, They'll catch a light on your barbecue. I'm not going to cook it on a barbecue, so I haven't uh, soaked them. And just put uh, four or five bits on each. And just keep going until, until you've used up all your meat. Depends on how big you've cut your, uh, your chicken to uh, how many skewers you're gonna make. But just continue on until you've got no meat left and then you're ready to cook. Okay, into a medium pan, or on a medium heat barbecue, or even on charcoal. Just pop them in. And just cook them until they're uh, 
got a nice nice brown colour for them and then uh, keep turning until they're ready and then we're ready to serve them up. Okay, there we go. There are the finished chicken tikka masala skewers. All you have to do now is at a party, just have the dip on the side with a spoon in it. Just put a little bit on your skewer and you're ready to go. The, uh, the, the dressing is fantastic. So uh, at a party, they'll walk out the door. So I hope you try it. Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching and uh, be sure to subscribe. See you next time.